ugly bastard. How have how you been doing, Richard? So street stock right now, there's two rows. This is row one. This guy here looks mean in front. Here, as well as the one behind it, I believe they ran Thursday. Back at it again here. I know the 2H did. Took a good lick up front, looks like, but he's back for some more. Good deal. I believe that's a little Cavalier. Good little runners. Those two twos in them. Not a lot of body, but good little runner. And this guy here looks mean up front. I believe he was here Thursday, too. I can't remember if he got to the feature or not. And this guy here as well was here, put on a good show, had some good shots. His axle got all bent up, looks like they bent it out. Put a new tire on it, ready for some more. This one here looks good, not a big car, but it's tough up front. Again, there's two rows. This is the back part. This guy here looks like he's ready for the dirt track, not a derby. Sharp looking car and the bumper up front is big and wide. He's got it bolted on. Looks like the stock bumper. So he's tough. And this one here is actually my ride from last Saturday. She didn't run very well, but she ran all the way to the end. Buick Lacrosse hoping she runs better today, at least for the first part until they start getting all bent up. So that's the end of the first row. There's another row of street stuff. Good looking car here, impressive motor up front. Looks mean. Got the lemonade in there, keep him cool while he's running, perhaps? There it is. And here's the second row of street stock. 518 to start, let's go. This guy here ran last Saturday at Jefferson County, put on some good licks, cross track. He's got a mean looking bumper up front this week. Expect to see him put on a good show again. Again, this is the second row street stock. I believe right now there's 20. Very sharp car here, big bumper up front. Smith and three. A lot of local people here. I'm not sure if that's the local Smith. I might actually know him. I'll have to ask, but it looks mean up front. Good looking car. And this one here as well. Burkett, they seem to come in together. Some nice looking builds. Got them crimped up. These guys put on a show, I'm sure. Love the sign. Again, a couple pre-ran cars. Some from Thursday, some just pre-run. That's kind of typical for this class street stock with a pro stock more so but a lot of guys with the street stock do it too this guy here saw some action somewhere as well oh, so i'm looking at ron he's looking at me I'm looking at cypher tears right. cypher had a good run thursday all the way down to third before he got too hot he said I believe the brothers are running these two. Dad's got a van here tonight. These cars look mean. Real nice. I'd like to see them running at the end. Very well done. Here's one that is stripped up front. Got a pretty good looking homemade bumper. Right around there, a Honda. The header coming out. Says 817 on the side, but 15B Adams on top. Right, so here's the minivan truck SUV. Small truck to start here. There's quite a few guys that are typical for this class. Very tough runners. Here's one here. 
We just ran this one down Day of the Dead New Alexander, I believe it was. Put on some big licks. She looks like she's pretty beat up, but I bet he's gonna be running at the end. Very good driver. Pretty fresh looking vans as well. That's a cool sign there. 305 Kreitzer, I believe would be how you say it. Pretty fresh new van. Here's another one. Looks like these guys might have came together, but have similar signs. Very cool. Twenty-five years of derby now. There you go. Somebody's in the sport as a lifer. Very nice. Again, a lot of local people typically come to the Clarence County Fair here in New Bethlehem. Cypher here. They're big time derbyers. Said his sons have two cars in the street stop. I'm sure he's going to be down there at the end. Too. Their small truck. This guy here was at Jefferson right, County Fair down. last week, put on a good show. His uh, left uh, axle here, his left front axle got all bent up, like pulled the CD shaft out. Looks like he fixed that up. Looks like he got a new strut in there too. Ready for some more action. Cool paint design as well. Old school van, very nice. Right now, I believe this is the Hobby Stock, Cascadon, again a local, another pretty prominent derby in the area. And this Matthews, I believe, right now are the only two, and I don't see any more in the pits. So I think for Hobby Stock, it might just be easy. Hey, it's just Lucas and Mark. Alright, alright. 